Hello, hello. Hey, you guys. guys guess, guess what time, time of day it is. It is Dollar Tree, Tree time for you all. all. Hello, our hello, friends. Hello, Hello, our family. Yes, mm -hmm, definitely. How the heck are you? What's going on? What's the four? One, one. Where you're at? Do tell, do tell. Mm -hmm. So, you guys, it is a lovely day outside. It's gorgeous, but mm -hmm. I cannot believe in the state of Michigan... Where we were 95 degrees pretty much the entire summer. And it just kills me that we have Labor Day weekend. Yeah. Then we go straight to fall. I mean. Yeah, it's been fall weather for sure. It's been. For sure. 30s you know. to 40s in the morning. And, you know, it's still getting. This week's going to be pretty nice. It's going to be 75 for the highs. It's perfect weather. Oh, week. for sure. I love that. I'm not complaining by no. Because no. me and summer don't mix. Because pretty much Mike will be outside at any given time, he'd be out in the rain if he, if I let him, okay? If I let him, like he's a child, he can do whatever he wants, right, baby? I guess so. Okay. But it still has to be within the limits of what you're telling me. Right. Anyway, so I don't like the heat. I don't mix with the heat. I can't be in the sun because of certain medication. Um, You give me some water and a chair and a little cocktail, ginger ale, I'm good. Mm -hmm. I'm good, I'm good, I'm good, because then I'll just sunblock it up and quit been complaining and just sit in the water. Yeah. But. Yes, we love, love, love. I love fall weather. It is absolutely my favorite, favorite, favorite time of the year because it's just crisp and kind of warm and cool, kind of sweatshirty weather, and yeah. and then you get the smells of the the pumpkins and the cinnamon and, and the nutmegs and the apples and all of the good crops that are coming out and lots of good stuff all that good stuff and then yesterday i gotta tell you a little story a little side, side note here mm -hmm. i said to mike i said mike they had a bushel of roman tomatoes for 15 dollars that's a hell of a price. That's a hell of a price. And I would have jumped on it, but then I would have had to go find the canner and the jars and all. Mm. It's just too much work to do anymore. And I love it. I, I mean, Mike and I used to do it all the time. But I used to make salsa and tomato juice, pickles. Pickles were the best for the kids. Yeah, the grandkids we, loved doing that, especially little Miss pickles. Hannah. She got right into that. And they weren't too hard to do. No, they weren't. But then, you know... You have to have everything, and I love all that stuff, and it, we gave it away as gifts, and we had fun with it, but then you just got to want to do it. But when I seen that $15, I'm like, oh, I can make salsa. Yeah, it's a lot. It's a lot of work, though. We used to do, you know, peach jam and apricot jam and things like monkey that. Butter. Monkey butter. Monkey butter. Anybody, comment down below if you guys know what monkey butter is, and no cheating. Don't look it up. Just tell me if you know it. Yeah, if you've had it before and no, or and or not, because it is the most delicious thing in the world. You put the, spread that on a um, English muffin that's been toasted with a little butter. Mm, yeah, mm, tastes like banana bread. Yeah, so good. Very good. Anyways, you guys are here for a haul, you all. So yes. let's get started. Holly, what do you think, babe? Shall sure. we? Yeah, let's just get pull some. Well, okay, let's it. just pull some off. Let we've, you talk about that. Uh, some, uh, some Christmas stuff here, and just quite a few, quite a big haul, I think. <clears throat> well. Ice cube tray again, people. Okay? There's two trays in here for a buck. We buy them quite often just because they always tend to break after you, you know, go like this and twist it to get the ice out of here once in a while, then they start breaking. Right. So, I think you're better off if you can find them somewhere else to buy them. It's just every time we go to like Walmart or anything like that, it's hard just to find a regular ice cube tray anymore. We want rubber made ones, but they are. I looked on Amazon and they were expensive. I'm like, I'm not doing that. So we can for for that kind of money, we can keep on buying these for a buck. So. Exactly. So, anyways, we've got some snackies here. Oh yeah, I must have been hungry. Somebody commented on the last video we did together that I uh, mentioned chips like a million times, and I must have they, they commented at least that I I must have wanted some chips, and that's pretty much true. Uh, this morning I went out and got chips and dip, so, um, I know, and two crazy. bags of chips too, but, uh, forgot I had these kind of chips, though, mm -hmm. uh, that we have, we're saving for a haul video, mm -hmm. so, this one is Chuck Savory, now these are, a uh, normal size bag, I, I like to call them normal size, it's almost 9 ounces, 8.75 ounces, it's a savory Chex Mix. Mmm, he likes mm -hmm. that kind, I like Chex Mix, but I only like plain. Yeah, it's very good. And I really so, like my sister-in-law's the best. Oh she yeah. needs to mark with that. Yeah, homemade Texas is awesome. 
And then uh, sweet barbecue flavored Better Made, which is uh, I believe a Michigan That's company. the kind I love. That's my favorite chip, but I don't like these. I like plain. I'm plain. Yeah, she just likes plain chips. So these are not plain, obviously. They're meant for me. Mm, yes, yes, but very, yes. Very yummy. And it's three and a half ounces in that one. Okay, let's so we see. We're just going to get this food business out the way. Yeah, I'll get the food out of the way, and then we'll get into some of the quote unquote good items. Okay. And then uh, she's handing me something here. Okay, what is that, babe? Uh, Swiss Miss Marshmallow. It looks like you've got six packets of it here. Okay. It looks pretty yummy. This time you're being fall. It's nice mm -hmm. to get some more of this stuff. So. I like to um, mix it with my coffee and my cream and make mocha. Mm -hmm. That's not a bad deal for buck for six. Oh my gosh. For, for, only way it works over here. For being a, uh, you know, a, a name brand. Okay. Oh wow. Those are my Brock's, my little gummy. These are my favorite. They're nice and soft, and I just like them. I'll put them in a little container, and I'll stick them in my craft room, and that's what I have. Mm -hmm. Unless a certain little girl named Kylie Mae comes over, and then they're gone. Mm -hmm. There's six ounces in there, so it's a decent regular size bag. Okay, guys, thank goodness this only comes around once a year, oh my because goodness. this is Kylie, and I made a nice little downfall here. We love them. They're mm -hmm. so good. Yeah, very good. We've hauled these a lot of times, and... So have other people and they are just yummy. Okay, so, so not very many in there. I found something that I could not believe that I found because I've watched all my YouTube uh, Dollar Tree hauler friends mm -hmm. haul this, and I thought there's no way I'm going to find this because I have a idea for a gift for my good friend Angie. Okay. All right, you hold one. There's three of them. I got these. What do they, they, they call this? A charger plate? This is a charger plate, okay? okay. So but what I've seen people doing, they're taking the cricket letters and like putting like something farmhouse, or I've seen them put like something red, Christmassy. Oh, yeah, that could go in there too. And I just think, because my friend Angie did her, um, redid her kitchen in farmhouse style, and it's just beautiful. I think she's going to be very happy. Or she's going to say, Lisa, can you give me some more so I can just do the whole table up? And I'll <laughs> say, Angie, you know how long it's going to be, how hard it's going to be for me to find that? Because it kills me. Not every story carries everything. And they are plastic, by the way. Just in case you didn't hear that when they were clinging. But for, a, for a, I shouldn't say a cheap gift. I didn't mean it like that. For a quick gift. Mm -hmm. This makes a really great gift because you just you spend a dollar on this, you get yourself one of those silver, uh, uh, they come in gold or silver little easel things, you stick that on there, and you put a little word on there. Mm -hmm. so, there you go. Three bucks and you're out the door. Yeah, very neat little gift to get. Okay, so we're going to go with this. Oh boy. Now, Lisa likes to get these pretty much every year. Because they just don't store real great. Right, don't store real great and then you gotta find them and then, you know, for a buck. You're in that closet somewhere. You know that closet over there, guys? Yeah. That one that Mike hates going in. I hate going in. And now, how big of a tree is this here? I don't know. Does it really say? I'm gonna say it's, it's tw at least 24, 36 inches. What do you think? No. 24? 16 inches? If it's as tall as this box is, this box is probably... That's probably 11, probably 15, 16 inches. It's got the feet on there, so it might be a little bit taller. But um, I, I don't know. It's just kind of. You're going to open it? He's going to open it. Anyways, I've probably got 10, not 10 trees. There's a lot of trees out there, but I like to put these little trees up like. We don't have a big place, but I'll put one in my craft room. I might stick one here in the kitchen. I don't know. I don't know what we're going to do because. It seems like we've done all this decorating our whole lives and just went crazy with it. And now that we're getting older, I don't like to use that word, but while now that we're getting older, it's like it takes a lot of work. I'm not going to open that up, uh, all, you know, threw them all down, but these little legs kind of go in there. Makes really little cute decorations. You know, these kind of fold down wherever you want them. <clears throat> For a dollar, you can't beat that, especially yeah. like if you've got some folks in like a nursing home mm -hmm. or something like that. You know, for a dollar, just to put a little tree in their little rooms, a little yeah. just makes them happy, and you know, yeah. all that good stuff. Okay, so we're gonna go to this. This oh, is yeah. Mike's good find because he likes them, and they're heavy, heavy, heavy. Yes, these are very heavy glasses. We bought a couple more because we keep kind of losing some of the other ones. Lisa says that 
I, I, I lose them and don't bring them back. I don't know how true that is, but but they're very nice. And I just like with nice, heavy drinking glasses. I don't know how many ounces it is, but probably, you know, 16 ounce or whatever. Why don't you ask him how many of these glasses we bought and how many he's brought home? It's like my Tupperware. I'm going to start asking for a credit card and insurance and all that. Hmm. To get my stuff back, what do you think? $15 dollar, baby. That's not the point. These are Anyways. Nice. So we got a two side of them. note, I know you guys have been seeing the hubs on with me a lot. You know what? I enjoy hanging out with this man. I love him. I adore him. We have fun. Yeah. I'm going to still do hauls. But I just want you guys to know I wanted to hang out with my old man. Mm -hmm. We do love doing... We <clears throat> do all the shopping together for the most part. Sometimes mm -hmm. she'll go by herself or once in a while I'll go by myself. But for the most part, we have done this together in one form or another for since inception. five and a half years. Yeah, since inception when I... First got her that camera and she started doing it and then she wanted to start including me in on the videos and it's just kind of been more and more so. So we have fun. This is yeah, and this like is our said, entertainment. We, right. we don't make like bunches of money off of this stuff. We, we spend more than we make a guarantee. We that. enjoy doing this. We like to be together. Mm -hmm. We like hanging out with you guys. Mm -hmm. I still do like doing my hauls. Mm -hmm. I am trying you guys so very hard to get my life together so mm -hmm. I can do some um, DIYs and things like that. I want him to do his funny little videos again. Mm -hmm. I thought those were hilarious and they were priceless. And, of course, his um, Sunday sauce would be nice. Yeah, that was always fun to do. Mm -hmm. so and then our lives. We're trying to get some more lives going. But, anyways, let's get back to the haul. Yes. Okay. Babe, explain. Lucy got some explaining to do. Okay. These are five blades, razors, and there's three of them in there, Okay. And these are just, uh, I don't even know what brand these are. They're, they're the Assured brand. Um, <clears throat> I had a brand there that I was getting. It was called the Reliable or Relia or something like that. But I haven't seen it lately. And those really lasted me, you know, a good couple of weeks of shaving each shaver. Uh, and I think there was like five in, in a bag. Uh, so I've been trying out some different ones. I bought some actual big ones there the other day. But those suck also because they're just cheapy big ones there's only two in a thing so but i'm going to try these haven't tried this brand yet but i will let you know okay i can't find my other books that i bought the oh yes they're right here <laughs> i'm losing it okay so you guys have already hauled this once before the Fortnite and the um mm -hmm. and the chicken soup for the soul the devotional stories for wives Okay, love this book. And then the Fortnite. Somebody had asked if I would get this for me, and I did. And then I got another set, because everybody loved this, and it's a big book. Oh, yeah, I check those books are expensive. I mean, they're just a nice little read. They really are. I mean, they, pretty, you can't beat it. Pretty quick read. So I'm going to keep this to do it for a give giveaway later on. So I just want to let you know that's what I'm doing. Yep. Okay. Hmm. Let's do these. You know... I love these containers, and here's why. Because you get how many are in here. This is the bonus one. This is four, yep. and they're Betty Crocker. Mm -hmm. um, and this is the size that we get. And this way, if we happen to have the kids over and they say, Hey, Mom, can we take something home? I don't feel bad because it's yep. a quarter. Or I bring them to work and I don't bring them back. Or if he doesn't bring them back, I don't want I just put it right in the trash, baby. You need to bring it back. It's a quarter. So. Right. And like she says, we try to get the same size so that if we lose a lid, we lose a bottom, they interchange yeah, later on. Took, took us a minute to catch yeah. that on. Because, you know, me, I'm like, oh, these are so cute, they're so cute, they're so cute, mm -hmm. blah, blah, blah. Well, before you know it, you got a, a handful of mismatched stuff. So he's right. Get the same ones, then we're done. Yep. Yeah, that's what we try to do. And sometimes you want some different ones, but we try to get, get it for the most part that way. All right. So, you know, Dollar Tree has tons and tons <clears throat> of frames, and I don't go crazy over them, but I have a particular picture of Mike and I um, when he went hiking, and it was about five years ago. Mm -hmm. And I love this frame because it's just cute, and when I get my room all done, it'll be in there. So, look at this. Oh, wow. That's a nice frame. It's got a little clip right here. You know, mm -hmm. it's got the little plastic. I mean, it's a Greenbrier product, but for now, it'll look really cute. Mm -hmm. And it's kind of a green color that I love. Yeah, I do like that. That is very... Mm-hmm. To put nice. on a mantle or behind... You know, I'll, I'll get it fixed up somehow. Some way, somehow. Okay. So then, 
Um, I found these are so cool. Kyla's seen them, and she's like, Grandma, can I have them? I'm like, <laughs> no, you can't even. I don't like to share my stickers. I'm terrible, but I am. Okay, so these are the new ones. 250 stickers. They come in a book form, and they just have just all kinds. Of, I mean, look how cute those are. They're nice, bright, and vibrant stickers. Right, and they've got the little puppies. Everybody loves the puppies. Mm -hmm. This is my favorite, the coffee cups. Aww. And it's just got some cutesy wootsy little things in here. I'll see if there's any. Oh, the slaws. Oh, yeah. Okay. <clears throat> slaws then, are a lot of people love the slaws. Then there was. Oh, that's, this is the one I want. Here we go. Okay, this is the other one. There's two of them. This is my fave. And I think you know why. Because it's got. Poop emojis. I got to tell you about that. Kylie <laughs> comes out of the room the other day with a, uh, an emoji. Poop emoji. She goes, Grandma, why do you have these? And I'm like, she's four and a half. I'm just kind of semi-explained to her why. So I kind of explained to her about my stomach that, you know, she knows about it as far as, you know, why is your stomach all messed up? And I told her about the little spot where I had my colostomy. And I just told her, explained to her what that was and why and this and that and that when I got it reversed. She doesn't quite understand that. That you guys were so kind to me and you sent like blankets and, and pillows and all kinds of poop emojis because every year I have a poop anniversary. So, and she thought that was the funniest thing. So, yeah. you know, little kids, they're funny. That was a life changer getting that reverse for her. Oh, you just aren't. Hmm. I remember praying that morning going, God, I can handle anything. And if I have to have this for the rest of my life, help me to figure out how I'm going to live with that. But if I don't have to have this, Lord, please let this be reversed. Because there was a chance when you have this that sometimes it'll go to sleep, your bowels will, and you can't wake them back up. That's what I was told. Thank you, Jesus. Yep. Anyway, so. Give me a guess who this is for. And it's not for me. Little Miss Kylie. I just thought, she's so pretty. Looks like my little Kylie girl. And there are lots of memories. She's going to love that. And then I seen Molly's Journey. Look at her. Isn't she cut? Cute little book. Yep. All right. How are we doing on time, honey? Good. Good, 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 good. good. Oh, you guys, I found a, oh, oh, I found a good deal. And you know what? I've been several Dollar Trees. I should have bought more, but I didn't want to be a greedy Greta. Old Spice. Here, you want to grab that, baby? Yeah, and they're 20 some ounces. 21 ounces, and this is a guitar solo. I don't Take know that. what that one is. Put it in between so your face shows. Okay, darling. How that goes. Okay. There you go. So these are the big ones. I'm thinking in my head that the reason they sold these is I think these were in a set. And they decided to, you know, they must have got a lot of them and separated them is what <clears> I'm thinking. Yeah, it was their 80th anniversary thing so maybe now who knows maybe they've been around for 82 years we don't know but so. that was a heck of a deal i bought four of these and mike was excited and you know what because it reminds me of my dad i took a little shower of one because i thought i like the smell i know i'm crazy okay They're very good we got some socks mm -hmm. we always seem to have this problem with losing socks i wonder why they go in a basket, and anyway. Anyways. So, I like I like these socks. I've bought these several times before and showed them on here. Or Lisa has also. Uh, it's the work socks. They're green briar. But these ones seem to really hold up. There's white ones and black ones that have this have the same label here. So I got two of those. And those seem to last pretty good. Now, they're not your top, top quality socks, but they last way better than... The other green buyer ones there that are just that don't say this work socks. For sure. These work sock ones just seem to be stronger. So, and then I got this. That's the bum brand. So I figured it would be a pretty good quality, and it might be, but it's just not my type of sock. I I tried. I have I bought two of these, and I I wore one the other day, and they're just really really thin when I pull them up over. You know, it's like uh, they they say they're wicking and all this stuff. Uh, got the sole but they're just not enough material there for me once it gets up around my leg uh the toe area things like that seem to be pretty good mm -hmm. um but if you like a really light sock 
this is probably good for you, but you right. know, we're coming into winter here in Michigan. This is not a great sock. He needs a little socks. Okay, so for me, I found the women's um, bum socks because I got to start getting my little collection of socks going because I'll be switching my shoes from my little summer shoes to my mm -hmm. other ones for the winter. So they look like, jeez, oh, Lisa. They've been coming up with a lot of these bum socks. Yes. They, it, it, it's just, and these are pretty name brand. I mean, they really yeah, are. Yeah, these are kind of thick, but mm -hmm. you don't, you get what you pay for. They're a buck. Right, these are distributed by Greenbrier people, so, uh, but must be they're using the bum name. Right. They, they distributed by Greenbrier, so they made these specifically for Greenbrier, which is pretty evident when you look down their sock aisle. Now, a lot of them have that brand name. Right. Okay, I was pretty geeked about this. This, yeah, is, this is a cool. light up door cover, and it lights up, it's battery included in pile comprise. Okay. Battery included. All right, this is what and it you, looks... Yeah, usually you get just the wall hangers, but this one actually has a light. So we're pretty excited about that. We probably won't turn it on too much because our, you know, I don't know. We'll see. Yeah. We'll see. We don't know what's going to happen around here. We don't know if they're going to have Halloween or not. We don't know how, what it's going to look like. We've never seen one of these before. So. Right, so there you go. Okay. We love it, we love it. You guys, I've I seen this. I had to get it for my little white Christmas tree. Mm -hmm. Uh, I like the Christmas tree skirt. And it said, I can't ever, you guys told me this the last video, I can't remember what that. I just call it checker pattern, but whatever. There you go, there's a name, I can't I, remember, whatever. It's got a little fuzzies here, it's really, really nice. Okay, I think Mommy Loves Gigi, Checker Channel out, showed this, and I thought that was so cute. Oh yeah. Happy Holidays, it's the little elf, I grabbed it now because it probably won't be there when I... You know, holiday time. Mm -hmm. So I've just been grabbing a few Very things. Very cute. Very cute. Very cute. Got it, honey? I got it, baby. I'll put okay. it over here. All right, you guys. This is another little find. <laughs> and my friend uh, Mimi Sparkles. Oh, Go yeah. check her channel out. Yeah, we love her. She channel. had the red one of these on, and I thought they were so cute. I had to, of course, get the black ones. Mm, yes. Oh, yeah. Bad, bad apples. Go beautiful with that hat. You look sexy, darling. Mm-hmm. That's awesome. Yes. There you go. And then I got these. I'm going to try these bad boys, huh? Mm -hmm. I won't tell you what that's screaming. It's screaming something, but um, I'm not going to. Bad. Bad is a bone. Uh, uh, bad is a bone. The day I was born. Mm -hmm. All the nurses gathered around. Yeah. I like that song. And it reminds me kind of like the blues better, too. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. So, then I found these. Oh, yeah. See? There you go. All right. Now, I like these with this hat better. Don't oh, you? Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's the that, styling with that on. Mm-hmm. Yeah. All I need is a little hat, too. And yeah, we could be... The Bobsy Twins. Yeah. Okay, so these are really cute. I don't know when I'll wear them because I wear glasses. And you guys don't ever see me in my glasses too often because it glares and drives me nuts. Okay. Mm -hmm. Why I keep buying these stupid things, but I do. Yes. We just like we, we just like to have lighters around. We just, mm -hmm. I mean, you can never have enough lighters around, as far as I'm concerned. And these are bigger than like regular lighters. Come on, baby, let my fire. They got a little bit more reach. We light our candles with them and things, so they just kind of reach down in there just perfectly. So there you go. Mm -hmm. And you should let them know they're refill refillable. Oh yeah, these are these are scriptos, by the way. So they're, they're name brand. Yep. And they are refillable. Yeah, on the bottom there, you just buy yourself a, a butane thing, and the butane fills right in there. Mm-hmm, exactly. Okay, so because Dollar Tree has these so cheap, throw your brushes away and go mm -hmm. buy new. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. Got two. All right. All right. So what do we have here? We got some uh, nighttime liquid capsules, 10 soft gels. With acetaminophen pain reliever. And it's basically compared to Vicks NyQuil. So it's a NyQuil, you know, compared to Vicks NyQuil brand soft gels, 10 of them, nighttime. So, very good. And I needed some more shaving cream. Um, I like this Barbasol brand from there. It's a nice little mm -hmm. can. Um, I don't, it lasts me a long time. I mean, when I buy this kind, it's like forever. Unless I sneak it and shave my legs. Okay, so I found some more ribbon, um, like I need it. Anyways, this is nine feet, 
They're both nine feet, and this is mm. the red trim. Oh, wow. Isn't that pretty? And then this is the green trim. Oh, very nice. Christmassy. Yeah. You yeah. ready for the Christmas crafting things? So, I heard on some of the channels that there's a new label out. I've never heard of this label, but Mike looked it up, and these are about $8 a piece. It's called the Fla it's Flower. Yeah, when you go to their actual flower.com or whatever it was, I think it was, and uh, they, that, that particular one sells for $8 on their website. Yep, and it's got, you know, the lipsticks in there. You can see. Very nice packaging. Mm-hmm, and then this is the other one. This is the same, uh, just a different color. This is... Ginger Lily. So I was pretty geeked about that because I needed some fresh new lipstick because, you know, I keep it forever and you're not supposed to. But anyways. Right. Last Very but good. not least, you guys, this is it. This is all that I have left of this haul. It's been a large haul. And so. it's this. Oh, yeah. Mermaids. Okay. I mean, you can either stick them on the wall or you could easily cut these out mm -hmm. and put them in for, you know, friend mail or whatever you want to do. Yeah. Oh, you can see that little... Crab. There you go. He's crabby. Yeah, so that, uh, we have a table full of stuff now, people. So we just want to thank you again. Uh, we forgot to tie up. Uh, make sure you like, comment, subscribe down below mm -hmm. if you like this video. Ring that bell if you want to see more from Lisa or myself. Uh, or together with all of us. And remember that snail mail. Because everybody likes getting something good in mail besides a... Damn bell. We know we do. Do something good for yourself so that you can do something good for somebody else and above all else. Hmm. Be, Be good. good. We love you.